Hey everyone, I'm here at Moab Canyon in Utah, in Moab, Utah. It's beautiful, another beautiful canyon. This, what, poison ivy, what's this about? It grows rather extensively in this canyon. Look at these pictures and avoid this plant. We do not want poison ivy. Yeah, okay, the three leaves. Got it. Beautiful little river. I'm already out of breath. I just got on the I just got on the trail. Oh god. <coughs> Nature. We're in nature. Should keep the camera in steady and not break an ankle. Well, that's nice. They kind of made they made stairs here. That's very nice. You guys can look at this while I'm looking at the ground. Hopefully I'm taking a good shot. I like the rambling. Beautiful. Just walking by a beautiful river. I wish I was on a date with a hot chick because I'd love to find a place and make sweet, passionate love in, the, in nature. Like the deer. Like the antelope. And like me. The cacti are indigenous to Utah. These are very nice cacti, indeed. Ooh, this is a slight angle. Let's see if I can adjust this ISO a little bit. I don't want to go too bright. That looks pretty good. Using the manual settings so we can get better video, hopefully. Ooh, let's just walk up these rocks, okay? I guess this is where the path goes. It said to bring a map. <laughs> I don't know. I didn't bring one. I can see the cars from here. Not too far yet. <clears throat> I'll just have to remember how far I went. Another rambling brook or rambling creek. Same creek, but it's still rambling. The birds tweet to tweet chimari their song in the desert and the savanna of the woodlands of Utah in the prairies of this beautiful, beautiful land. Once the proud home, ooh, where's this water coming from? It's perhaps a spring somewhere. This could be slippery here. Where's the spring at? There's some water coming down the mountain. That could be ice that melted from this morning. Don't want to slip on a wet rock. Ooh, look how slippery that looks. That looks quite slippery. Yes, it does. Yes, it do. Ooh. Some other hikers. Hello. How far did you guys go? All the way to the end. Oh, really? How far is that? Uh, I think uh, altogether about two and a half, three miles. Holy cow. 
Yeah, about two and a quarter, two and a half. He's Is it lying. beautiful down there? He's yep. lying. It's beautiful, but there's no beer back there. That's oh, there's beer? No, oh, that's what he no promised. That's there's what he down. promised me. <laughs> Hey, whatever works. There's some beer and hoagies back there waiting for us. Some pizzas. Is there like a waterfall though? Oh. Oh, yeah. oh, that's where we're walking to the big arch. Oh, is this the main arch that everybody? Oh. Okay. Where's the big arch at? You just drive through. Oh, that's the. Yeah. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, Thank it's you. A lot do you have to pay to get into Arches Park? Yeah. Oh. Is it 30 bucks too, like the other ones? I don't know what it is, but it's worth it. Yeah? Oh, yeah. It's amazing. All right. I've got to go then. I'm already out here. Is that how long it is to Arch, to Delicate Arch? Yeah. Okay. I drove through Escalante. Uh -huh. That was a crazy drive. That was epic. <laughs> oh, my gosh. And then just out in the middle of nowhere forever. Before, every time I saw a gas station, I filled up because I didn't know when the next time would be. Where are you from? I'm from Indiana. Oh, what part? Um, I'm from around Indianapolis. Right. Oh, wow. <laughs> I have some family from Elwood, too. That live, well, they're not from there, but they're, uh, they live there now. So it was close to Kokomo where my uncle works for Chrysler. Oh, there you go. Small world. Indiana folk gotta go out and discover the world too. <laughs> smells like some skunk out here or something. You smell it? Something. I thought maybe somebody smoking some ganj. <laughs> Fine with me. Whew. What did I do? Oh, yesterday I went to Bryce. That was awesome. Have you guys been down to Bryce Canyon? Oh, yeah, that was my first time. I was blown away. Oh, you guys moved out here? Oh, wow. Wow, it's just beautiful. This is... I can't really fabricate this beauty in my mind. It's like... If I was going to try to paint some nature painting or something... This is crazy. So are you just out here on a, on a car trip? Yeah. Well, I moved to L.A. for a year, and then I decided I was going to drive back home to Indiana for Thanksgiving and, and head out east and stuff, too, after that. Uh -huh. <clears throat> I was going to go out to New York for a month and then drive down to New Orleans for, for Mardi Gras and then go to Austin for South by Southwest in March. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I'm just out on an adventure right now. I don't have a girlfriend, and I just do internet videos, so I'm able to fund my trips and stuff doing that, making videos. So I'm making a little video right now for the for my YouTube channel of just recording, walking around the trail and stuff. It's just so pretty, and a lot of people don't have the means to go on a trip like this, so. It's cool, like, film hike? yeah, I'm just oh, filming everything. You gotta do delicate arch. Yeah. Oh my god. The hike for that? Because what happens is you don't see it until you're right at the bowl of that arch, and it's amazing. Oh wow. You're the reveal. Like this, and all of a sudden, it's like you go up around the edge of that rock, and it just opens <coughs> up into this. Oh. Yeah, it really is. <laughs> cool. I walk, went on some random trail in, uh, where was it, in Zion National Park that was awesome. It opened, went way by a river, and then it opened up in this beautiful little oasis waterfall that was pretty neat. Where was this again? That was in Zion National oh, Park. Sure. Yeah. yeah. I did the Grand Canyon. Yeah, I'm just, I did a Antelope Upper and Lower Canyon. That's fun. I, I like the lower canyon one better. As far as yeah. it was like twice the distance and it's a lot more of an adventure, like climbing up all these like scaffolding and things they built. Oh, it's yeah, it's pretty neat. 
When's the last time you guys went back to Indiana? Oh. Uh, oh, okay. Went back to go help him out. Yeah. That's nice. My grandma and my grandpa, they moved into an assisted living, like, residence place. And, yeah, they, she liked it. She made friends with people there and stuff. Yeah, the people adjust a lot better than they think they Yeah. But, yeah, it's never easy, though. It's when you've had your independence your whole life and right. everything. My grandma had a stroke, so she had to, like... Go to a place like that, but that's yeah, cool. My dad went and visited her like a lot, like pretty much every morning. So I'm sorry, you're from Kokomo? No, I'm from uh, just like outside of Indianapolis. Oh. Yeah. Oh. 